Get ready! You're tuned in to Tea Time Unfiltered with your girl, Lovely T, bringing you the hottest trending topics on social media. Stay connected. Instagram.com slash Lovely Tea 2002. Hey, you guys. Welcome to another episode of Tea Time Unfiltered with your girl, Lovely T. Yeah! Hey, you guys. Happy Friday. I hope you guys are doing good today, honey. So welcome to another episode of Tea Time Unfiltered. And I definitely had to go to the podcast on this one, okay? So for y'all who don't know, shout out to all my Discorders and my Instagrammers because y'all kind of saw the drama go down this morning. So yesterday after I did my live stream, I ended up going to sleep kind of early because I was really tired. Um, so I woke up this morning kind of early <laughs> and um, I'm going through my emails and I noticed that I got two emails from YouTube support so I was kind of confused like damn what the hell is going on here so I click on the emails and, it, and the emails basically state that I got not one but two privacy complaints from an individual regarding my content so I'm like damn privacy complaints okay well let me go ahead and click the link and see what videos these are it pops up Shekinah Joe gets a restraining order against Sabrina Peterson a video from three years ago so then the second video that was also submitted for a privacy complaint comes up. T.I. and Tiny deny Sabrina's allegations. Plus, Shekinah Joe breaks down crying and backtracks full breakdown. So that was the live stream that I did this weekend. And so at, at first, I didn't really have proof right away. But I suspected it was Shekinah because Shekinah had also slid into my DMs. Um, I didn't open them. And then she also sent me a friend request, which I just ignored. Um and I guess because I ignored her and paid her no attention, she got mad and tried to go run and file a privacy complaint on me. So this is what I posted on Instagram. I said, one of these four people tried to file a privacy complaint on me late last night. It was either Shekinah, Sabrina, T.I. or Tiny. If I were a betting person, I would say with Shekinah. She must be in her feelings again because I kept the 100 in my live stream about how she tried to demand that I take down my video only to use my content to help her a year later in her case against Sabrina. So now you're filing complaints on me because I don't want to respond to your DMs. Let me tell you something. I don't care who you are. You have one chance with me. Once you have shown me your true colors, you will never get a response from me or waste my energy. Hence your DM messages being ignored. I'm tired of you harassing me when I've done nothing to you. I even still defended you in my most recent live stream. But now that you keep trying to silence me, I wonder what the fuck you're trying to hide if you have nothing to do with the BS. Like I said, she's the most likely suspect, but I don't put anything past these heat weirdos so that's what I wrote on Instagram it had a lot of likes comments and so then people made me aware that Shekinah had did a live stream and people recorded her and during her live stream she had stated that she was going to start going after bloggers on YouTube with her lawyer to get the content pulled down so I want y'all to listen to this really quick Yo, what's up? Hey, tea sippers to listen to the rest of this podcast, please go to Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Google Play, Stitcher, Tuned In, or AnchorFM.com, which is a free podcasting site. Thank you guys so much for the support, and stay tuned for the next video.